this is the uh just cut it out just finishing cutting that out look uh mid sanding down see a little bit rough in places i've got to sand all that sand it all down and shape it a little bit you never get a good cut with that jigsaw it's always a little bit misshapen so we've got to we've got to work on that um but it looks like it Gonna fit this one. There, look. That's the start of making a porthole for this window. It's a bit rough in there, and I've got to sand all that down. Perhaps I can grout the edges. Um, grout. I mean, grout it. Not grout it. And there we are. Uh, that's the start of the porthole. I've got to get some inner flexible inner um, wood so I can glue on the inside a bit like this here look this is just that's just thin flexible wood to glue on the inside um, try and that bit of wood there it's just a bit of thin wood it's a bit bendy just glued together uh, so I'm going to try and get some really thin flexible wood like I'm making to a circle and um, glue that and hopefully make a porthole out of it somehow I'm not a porthole specialist never made one before I don't really know what I'm doing but I've got a general idea of what needs to be done but it's um, doing it sand all this down I'm going to paint it so I'm not really bothered about all these marks and stuff it's going to be painted the same as these portholes with that um, natural hessian colour, which I think will go nice with the white. That's the um, result of sec cut number two. Cut number one was a failure. Cut number two seems to have worked. Oh, there we go. Thanks for watching.